Hi boys and girls, we're going to go ahead and do poetry today. Our poem that we're focusing on is this one called September. Yeah, that's the month we're in. That's what we've been doing on our calendar. So I thought it'd be fun to do a poem titled September. Now, this is not in your poetry book, but I did link it and I handed it out for you guys if you need it, okay? Each month we're going to do a new poem for that month. So this is our poem for September. Okay? I want you to get your big pointer fingers ready and follow along with me as I read it. Can you do that? Awesome. Way up high in the apple tree, two little apples smiled down at me. I shook that tree just as hard as I could. Down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. What? That's so silly. Let's read it one more time. Turn your listening ears on. Just need you to listen and follow along with your finger, okay? Way up high in the apple tree, two little apples smiled down at me. I shook that tree just as hard as I could. Down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. I think this is backwards. All right, so today I want you to read this poem two more times with mom or dad or big brother and sister to help you. And then your job is to color all the apples in the tree. Color the whole tree, okay? Now, each day I want you to read this poem two times and I want you to try to memorize it. That means say it without having to have someone help you. But I know that's gonna be hard on the first day, so I want you to practice and then hopefully by Friday you can have it memorized. I also would love for you guys to find all the letter L's and the letter O's that you can in this poem. Take that highlighter and highlight all those letters. And then on Friday, if you guys are feeling brave, I want you to try to perform this poem for someone in your family. That means you stand up and you say the poem to them without any help. Now, if you need a little bit of help, that's okay. But I want to see who's big and brave enough to do it in front of other people. Good luck!